Okay, uh, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Let me study the dynamic model of blending system with isothermal and variable hold up. The variable hold up means the volume is not constant. So, for the process, we can draw in this. So, there is a blending, blending system between stream 1 and stream 2 with a composition H2 and the output stream uh, installed from the bottom of this uh, tank with a flex, mass fraction X and flow rate Y to make sure that a perfect mixing we install the stirrer so here W is mass flow rate and X is mass uh, fraction so W1 and W2 mean a mass flow rate from stream 1 and stream 2 here we assume that uh, perfect mi mixing occur in this process and also we assume constant density constant density so how to derive the uh, differential equation of this uh, case so first from overall mass balance from overall mass balance we can derive that uh, accumulation is equal to input minus output here the mass input is W1 plus W2 mass output is W and the accumulation is uh, mass in accumulation is rho V because the V vary f, uh, every time then V will change uh, respect to time okay so this is our first differential equation so uh, and the component mass balance component mass balance can be written as accumulation of component A is in uh, component A input mass of component A in input stream subtract by mass of component A at output stream so at input stream the component A will be mass flow rate time mass fraction so mass flow rate time mass fraction is mass component A flow rate plus W to X2 minus W X so the accumulation here is rho v x so v x is the uh, x is frax mass fraction v is volume and rho is uh, density so rho v is mass rho v is mass so mass time mass, uh, mass fraction in accumulation should be the ac uh, accumulation component A in the tank so here V yeah, put V and X varies every time so we uh, V and X yeah, we uh, put the V and X in the 
derivative uh, form. So now we call it as second equation. Okay, so uh, this second equation yeah, we can uh, we can separate into two part using the using the chain rule so how to solve dx we have d, dv so how the dx so from the from rule chain yeah. rule or chain rule sorry chain rule yeah. if we have t m m of a dt we can solve this equation m constant we consider m constant dn of a dt plus n dm of a dt so this is the rule chain for the differential equation dm and so in our case we have root d v x v and x we uh, can derive that v x d v x is v d x d t plus x d v d t okay so uh, the rest equation we write on okay now we have the uh, equation like this and we uh, know that tv dt is here so tv dt is here so we can uh, replace this tv dt to this uh, value so uh, uh, we can uh, substitute the tv dt to x uh, tv dt is w1 plus w2 minus w is w1 x1 plus w2 x2 minus w x so then uh, the dx of a dt uh, okay i've written this space okay uh, dx of a dt is w1 x1 plus w2 x2 minus w x minus w1 x minus w2 x plus w x over rho p or dx dt can be simplify you see okay, because uh, this value w x minus plus w x plus then we can simplify the uh, differential equation like this x1 minus x plus w2 rho v x2 minus x okay so this is our uh, dx of a dt 
differential equation okay so actually now we have dv dt and dx dt uh, we can solve this equation simultaneously using uh, any program okay so this is the dynamic model of blending system isothermal with variable variable hold up or the volume is not constant